So today we have our dredging operation with beach plenishment. We're placing sand along the Rockaway shoreline between Beach 9th Street and Beach 149th Street. Approximately two and a half million cubic yards of sand will be placed along the shoreline and it's all coming from the offshore borrow area. The sand is hydraulically placed with the Dredge Illinois. That's a cutter suction dredge. It's a 30 inch cutter suction dredge. It's a powerful piece of equipment and a uh, submerged pipeline helps transport that material from the borrow area to the dredge and to the beach. This right now is part of our contract two, part of the Sandy uh, Resiliency contract, and we'll be doing this for the next few months. The total cost for contracts one and two is approximately $350 million. Contract one, which is our grind construction, was awarded for approximately $115 million. Contract two, which is the reinforced dune, beach replenishment, and also the uh, beach access points was awarded for approximately $225 million. That covers the entire Rockaways from Beach 9th Street to Beach 149th Street, which is approximately seven miles. A project like this is designed to protect the critical structures that exist behind me. Homes, small businesses, the boardwalk for recreation. It's a temporary, it's a, it's a band-aid on a problem. I mean, we, we have a serious climate change problem. Uh, we're, we're going to get and are getting more intense storms. We are getting, and, and it's going to get much worse, accelerated sea level rise. Um, and beach nourishment, um, you know, that sand is easily moved. And uh, when you, you've been to the coast after sand or even a, a, a typical nor'easter, uh, you can see the changes to the beach that the waves and, and tidal currents will cause. We really need to be thinking about moving away from the shoreline. Nobody, nobody wants to hear that. And as far as, uh, as long as we have the core willing to put hundreds of millions of dollars of taxpayer public money into beach nourishment, and FEMA has a, a flood insurance program that repays people uh, when their houses are damaged during storms, um, you know, there's not a whole lot of incentive for people to move away.